Oh, what is going on everyone? We are changing the oil today. It is almost boating season, so we're unwinterizing the boat. So we are changing the oil. Alrighty, so we got the fake lake on. We're gonna warm the boat up to thin the oil out. And then we are going to pump the oil out of the dipstick. And here's the little pump we have set up just to a drill. Here's the dipstick. You can also drain your oil via this method, gravity, but that takes way too long. So we're gonna turn the water on and get her warmed up. Water, ready? Okay, Judy, turn the water on. Go ahead and crank it. turn the engine off we had a bit of a problem with the pump not pumping out the oil from the from the dip sticks so we're gonna try the alternate method there is a, a hose that runs from the bottom of your oil pan and so this hose then runs to here which goes through the boat All right, we're gonna pull the oil filter off here. Just putting a rag underneath the filter. Any residual oil that falls out will collect in this rag instead of the bottom of the boat. And then we're gonna take it off the inside of this. There we go. All right, here it goes. Yep. All right, here's the new oil filter we're gonna put can you on. Put any oil around it? I have. There's enough residual in here. I can get some. <laughs> All right, that's gotta be on tight enough. All right, got the new filter put on. Still waiting for the oil to drain out of the pan. We're almost done. And then we will fill it up via the new oil that are above the valve cover. All right, filled her up with oil. We're turning the fake lake back on. Crank it. And that's how you know the fake lake is working if it's come out of the exhaust. Now check the oil level. Check the old dipstick. Right where we were prior. One more for five because we put five quarts in. Yeah. Yeah, I mean it's right there. That's where it was prior. Well that that was not too hard. It's time consuming. Find a extracurricular activity to do while you do this. We couldn't figure out where the plug was for the bottom of the boat and it's like a little uh it's this brass little thing right here next to some of the pumps for the ballast so if you're ever looking for it it is right here all right well that's gonna do it for the old oil change on the boat we learned a lot today uh, the first plan of attack did not go as planned the pump was not pumping any oil out of the dipstick so like I said we had to end up going with the drain technique which only took about well I say only it took about two hours you know when you drain oil out of a car it takes like 20 minutes tops if you're trying to get every last little drop out so I was not used to the slow drip of a, of a boat oil change um, if you have any questions about what we learned throughout the process certainly leave a comment below uh, interested to see if anyone else has learned anything new when they've changed the oil or any other fluids on their boat for that matter uh, good process though like I said good to learn something new so 
hopefully anyone trying to change their oil has learned something new today and thank you all so much for watching. We'll see you all later.